Wait. Hold on. Why is my camera on? What's going on? Where where am I? Wait, am I on YouTube? Am I on my YouTube channel? Holy shit. It's been nine months since I uploaded a video on this channel. Sorry. Hello. <laughs> Hi, uh, if you do not know me, uh, I'm Ozranium. Uh, most people on here or uh, anywhere else call me uh, Oz or Ozzy. Uh, when I'm in usually my VTuber or PNGTuber form, uh, I'm a Celestial Adrazi Planeswalker. Uh, and uh, I always just say I'm a competitive, I'm a very competitive gamer, mostly right now in Apex and Nintendo. And uh, I'm here uh, to talk about where have I been for the f for nine months and just gather my thoughts and talk about um, what I need to do to change and to start making content on this channel again. And uh, I'm just going to get the quick questions out of here. Yes, I am reading a script. I want to make sure I have a collected thoughts and make sure I keep my mind on track before I go off tangents about, I don't know, Apex or Plants or Zombies or whatever. Okay? And two, I don't need glasses. These are blue, tint, uh, blue light glasses for my computer because, as you can see, it's fucking bright in front of me. So I'm, uh, I'm trying to protect my eyes. Thank you very much. Okay? <laughs> So, uh, let, let's, let's get to the, I'm going to make a timeline basically of kind of a rough timeline on where have I been and what I kind of just did for, uh, the past nine months. Uh, so around October, um, Adobe kind of just, I lost my editing software. So Adobe took away in Premiere Pro for me, uh, even though uh, I had a new card and it was working fine before with Photoshop and all the other services I used for Adobe. But for some reason, until this past few days, Premiere Pro, I couldn't even get the license again until now. And it's, I don't want to get into semantics with that, but it took a while, but I finally fixed it and hopefully it will be good to stay. If not, I will post a channel, post about it again. Just just to, just to let you guys know and stuff like that um uh then around uh january of this year now um i lost my job um to be honest i got terminated from my job because they said they didn't need me and um, I admit, I, um, I fucking, I broke down. I just was at, my heart sank because that job that I got, um, I was working there as a part-timer for two and a half years. And so that was like my main support on paying rent and doing uh other stuff on this channel and on my other socials and it, it sucks losing your job and i've talked to other people that work there with me and they also lost some of my friends some of my uh colleagues there also lost their jobs uh and it was it was tough it was tough and um i had to deal with um trying to find a job again um it's as you can see it's may and i i haven't been it's been hard trying to find a job in four months uh for me and stuff um i'm just gonna say it on 
I tried unemployment, the, the stuff with the government. I'm not going to get into semantics on that one, but it's, it's, it's hard. Uh, but, um, right now I am, I am in potential, not certain, for a job interview, uh, very soon. And I'm excited to finally get another job to finally support myself again, which is, uh, great. Uh, I hope to get it. If I don't, then it's no big deal, but I'm gonna still keep searching, of course. Um... And because of losing my that job, um, all my effort was focused into my Twitch channel. Uh, Twitch.tv slash Ozradium. Go down below to follow it. But no, no, no. Uh, all jokes aside, um, I just mainly focused on Twitch for about those four months. So I f seven days a week tried to stream every day for seven days a week and let me tell you it it's tough it's tough it's especially tough when you are i guess a relatively small channel trying to financially support themselves but barely get barely enough money to pay rent it it's it's horrible it's horrible i'm i love my twitch channel i love my twitch followers and everything but i'm sorry for you guys that really tried and stuff like that and i'm just sorry that i couldn't really i felt like i didn't put enough effort into it even though i tried to and i'm just sorry I'm, I'm sorry there's no i wish i did better honestly i wish i did better and wish i did more pre effectively and stuff um, and yeah. And also in the nine months, uh, I guess it's kind of just old, old news now, but I had my fair share of, uh, meeting other VTubers and then trying to be friends with them, but also stuff not going the right way and topics that um, topics that just bug people and it's just you clash. It, people, people just clash, and the same goes for myself. I, uh, I have autism. Uh, I, I will clash with pe other people who ha are, who you know have different personalities and stuff like that. So there's gonna be problems, and I've had my fair share of drama. Um, I'm not gonna share what on the here but i've had my fair share of drama but we went through it and i'm better now. i'm trying to be a better person now I'm trying to be a better person 100 <sighs> percent so um <laughs> uh i'm gonna just outright say this line that what i told myself on the script uh be honest with what you want to say about your youtube channel First of all, I'm going to give another apology to you guys, to to the YouTube viewers that have been here for years. I'm just going to give apologies, and I'm sorry. Um, all the update log videos that I've kind of did in the months before, and then, you know, try to do stuff. I hate them. I I felt like I gave you false hope for stuff that didn't happen, and it it was wrong of me to um, really do that. And I'm I'm generally sorry that I did that to any of you. And if you guys are hurt now, I'm sorry. I want to be better, and I want to make up for the mistakes I have done on my YouTube channel. And yeah. I hope you guys can forgive me and we can all move past this together in a more happier and brighter state on the channel. Um, and 
I honestly don't like the state of my channel. Um, I think one of the also things that I kind of just didn't really talk about much is I I missed the first videos that I've done on this channel. If you guys notice, my most popular YouTube video is the Landmark College Super Smash Brothers documentary that sits right now 700 plus views. I pretty sure on the top of my head and um that was a college project that i did when when i was in college three years ago no five uh what was it i'm thinking i think it was four yeah four years ago yeah four years ago i believe four years ago three to four four five four five years ago i'm not sure anymore it's time flies uh, with, uh, with my friends and my, uh, my college colleagues, and I'm just, I miss doing that shit again. I miss doing that shit and actually putting more effort into these videos and actually kind of just f not fucking around, but, um, trying to make funny jokes also within it and stuff like that. And I kind of miss that, that era of my YouTube and stuff like that. Um, I'm not really a fan of some certain videos on my channel. Um, for example, the guilty, my, my only guilty gear video, uh, my Stardew video, Undertale, even some of the Mario parties. Like there's some, there, there are good Mario, there are some good Mario parties that I have posted on the channel, but there are other Mario parties that are just don't feel like they have enough essence to be funny or good enough in my eyes and it's not because of anybody in particular no the people who did mario parties with me that are that are uploaded to the youtube right now um uh, before not these not the future ones but the ones now um they probably put in their the effort they can to be funny on my channel and i appreciate that I think it was just a problem with me and what I wanted for a Mario Party video. I think that's why. I think I'm trying to copy a, a system that is either good or bad depending on how people see it. All right. Um, and then um, I've I've had a lot of. Uh, <laughs> original characters I've used since I've been doing social media with YouTube and Twitch and Twitter, whatever, where I went from human to furry to Octoling to Dark Elf to now the newest or the most current uh, era, which is my Celestial Eldrazi Planeswalker. And to be honest, I... I fucking adore my, uh, my, uh, I adore my design. I love it. I love it. it still perfectly encapsulates what I like as a character and what I want to portray as a character for to be a VTuber soon. But I'm just a PNG tuber now. And let me just say, it's, it's not that it's hard. It's just... It's just there's this there's a certain stigmata when it comes to fucking the scene and it's just it's like I don't I kind of want to just do my stuff my own way and I kind of just wish that and this is my opinion but I feel like just VTubers are just content creators with just another name plastered to them it, it that's just how it is for me and how I see it. And maybe I may, and you know, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm wrong, and maybe I gotta change my, maybe I gotta change my perspective about that. But uh, it, I, it's it's a lot of money to fought to d do this shit, and I'm like, I am fucking, I, my money's spent on for other stuff right now. I can't really do that right now. So I'm like, I'm not, I'm not leaving the V, I'm not leaving, I'm not leaving the VTuber scene. No, 
or the PNG tuber scene. No, I'm still going to try to put that shit out there. It's just, um, I'm very particular with my design and my assets, <laughs> as you can tell. So I'm going to find, I'm going to eventually, when I have the chance to do so, to eventually find artists and riggers and more to help me with uh, becoming a fully fleshed VTuber and actually creating a character for you and stuff like that. That is how I feel about it. Um, uh, so, as I stated before, it's time for a fucking change. It's time for a change on this channel. 100%. 100%. No false hope shit, nothing like that. No. I'm going to give you my full on it. Okay, I'm gonna try to give you my 110% on this shit because I am sick of uploading a few videos, leaving for a few months, uploading a few videos, leaving for a few months. That shit is boring as fuck and I'm done with that shit, man. I am done. It's not, it's not fun when I do that and it's, uh, and I, and I'm sorry, it's, I gotta change my, how I do this shit on here. Honestly, yes. So, here are what is going to happen with this channel. So, first of all, I have a backlog of a lot of Mario parties that I have streamed on my Twitch. 100%. I need to quickly edit those and upload the, those first. Before I make any content that I'm, ha I'm going to be like putting, putting my full effort and my hopefully improve my editing techniques with I got to first upload those Mario Party bots 100% of course edit it down like what Mario Party TV does and try to make it as wonderful and, and appreciated as possible and stuff so when you pro after these properties uh, I guess update log you're probably gonna see Mario Party bots again soon I don't know when but I'm just gonna I'm just gonna keep going. I'm gonna see how long I can go in and find the vods that are good. Then I'll post them. Uh, now here is what's gonna be on this channel specifically. After the vods, um, I'm gonna go full on in as I'm gonna call them con uh, essays. So I'm we're gonna call them projects or essays. This this type of content is going to be for. Uh, talking about my favorite games that I haven't really, or like that I haven't really talked about here. I haven't really talked to anybody, not even on my Discord, or anybody about. I'm gonna talk about cre some creepy pasta content that I want to talk about, and some content that I feel like that should be uploaded to YouTube. I there's certain content I feel like I should want to talk about, and it's and even movies, even movies, certain movies I do want to talk about, right? I want to just. I want to get out of my comfort zone and not just play games on the channel, but make fully fledged essays and talk about my thoughts on whatever I want to do and what floats my boat on for what I like and what I don't like, you know? So, uh, prepare to see more. That's going to be like my main video projects for the, not just this year, but probably the rest of the channel going forward where... I'm gonna probably make. Don't quote me on this, okay? <laughs> I'm maybe once a month. I'm gonna sit down, make a fucking essay about a certain video, a certain topic that I like, and make it a video, and then upload it to your channel and see how that does. You know, see how that does. Um, so that's the that's the that's the first one. The second one, um horror game content uh now um if you guys are an oldie when it comes to my twitch um i have streamed horror game content on my twitch for a bit but it doesn't seem to do well for uh, anal uh, when i check my analytics on that and why is from the and it doesn't seem to do well on twitch just in general for me compared to my other games and stuff so um, I'm gonna be making horror game content on this channel. 
I have uh, one of the actually you, one of the YouTube viewers that actually I met on your chat before. I'm not gonna say his name because um, uh, he's he, you can find him on the Discord. But um, he gifted me like a bunch of horror games, horror like horror games on Steam, and I'm like, oh shit, like these games look fucking amazing! I can't wait to play them. So what I'm planning on is I'm going to try to do more recording sessions with uh, certain VTubers that I want to collab with. Not stream-wise, no. Collab with for like a recording kind of thing. Um, and like, Kind of like if you know Oni Plays or of course, um, or of course like, uh, of course Jack Septicai and Marky Plyer. And like any of the or 8 bit Ryan, any of those kind of games, uh, any of those kind of horror games that they play, and maybe just maybe trusted friends that I know in my community and stuff, and just play horror games and actually feel the intensity of the horror because horror can I feel horror can really bring out the best in a person when playing. Depending on the horror game. Depending on the horror game. But that's what's going to happen for this channel. Where it's going to be Project Net Safe and Horror. That's it. Uh, I'm going to limit to there. Um, the only other thing I would post on YouTube would be Twitch highlights. And that's like Twitch clips from my Twitch. Stuff like that. And um, yeah. That's really where I want to go moving forward with that, with this channel. 100%. Um, now, um, I'm not just going to talk about my channel, I'm going to also talk about my Twitch, where I stream <laughs> frequently. <laughs> so, um, since I'm back on YouTube, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try, I'm going to really try, really try. Um, I'm gonna try to limit on how many times I stream now and um, focus certain stuff on Twitch. So, um, one thing is going to be uh, the Apex Legends. So, I'm gonna be playing that for around half, half of the days I play because I'm a ranked grinder and I want to become a pro player in that game. Uh, I've tried being a pro player in Smash, you know, Mario Kart, fighting games. I kind of just want to continue on one game for as long as I can. And I feel Apex Legends is a perfect way for me doing that. Of course, you know, I'm an MK player, so they want the controller players, but I'm going to still try to make my name for myself in that game. And I love that game, and I really want to shine in that I f and I, f I feel I have the, the talent I just need to hone in on certain things and bring my talent and make it special that's all and um, second thing will will be viewer games one one stream for a viewer game and then story king content for like weekend stuff so like cuphead like what I'm doing right now or just stuff that people want and we get we get it from the sub goal from the sub goals and stuff like that i think would be perfect uh and yeah i think that's a that's like that would be a good stuff for twitch and just mainly do stuff there perfect you know different stuff on both my youtube and twitch and i want to keep it i want to keep it that way and i want to see how that goes um now before i leave you all um i just wanted to talk about what is my ultimate goal? Uh, what I want to do for to try to finish off this year, because I really want the summer—not just the summer, but the fall and winter this year—I want it to really shine. I really want to push forward with my content and stuff like that. So, here are my goals for this year. Um, I want to gain around 5,000 subscribers on this channel on YouTube. Um, I really want to make this the biggest channel I have and not just 
my biggest is not on Twitter. <laughs> I really want to push a lot more effort onto YouTube and I really want to gain some growth and I won't really want to push forward. Um, next, um, I kind of just, um, I already have a goal on Twitch, which is to get a thousand followers on Twitch, but I kind of want to, I put it in a range where I kind of just want a thousand to 2,500. So, you know, which is half of 5,000 by the way. So, so like a thousand to 2,500 followers on Twitch. And, um. Yeah, I kind of just want to do it like that, where it's like, yeah, I have, good, I have good stats on Twitch, but, you know, I don't really need that much on Twitch. Um, and um, lastly, I guess, 1,000 on Twitter. This is just like a no-go kind of, no-big-deal kind of thing. But, yeah, that's it. Is That's it. If it leaves 1, 1K on Twitter, oh, I'm, I'm happy. I'm not happy. Uh, and then, I think lastly... Um, I just I need to I need to better balance myself being do more IRL stuff with bring bring it back to my IRL side like you know, stuff like doing percussion and surfing all that junk, but also becoming a pro player in Apex and also being a YouTuber and stuff. I think that's that's like the most the hardest shit. But um, I kind of just want to do that because I really want to be happy and with my life and I feel like doing my own thing like that is what's gonna make me happy and yeah I I have nothing more to say about that but uh I have the, it's not that I don't have anything to say about it but it's like uh it is what it is <laughs> but um if, um, I just want to say um, uh, thank you um, to whoever watches this, uh, all the old viewers that have stayed with this channel, and all the new ones that might come around. Thank you so much for watching this video or my other content, stuff like that. Just watching my content is it's just the the best way to help support me and i'm thankful for all of the years that i've done it so far and i really want to continue doing this and i don't really want to i don't want to leave and i don't want to end end my channel i really want to uh do more and i want to make you guys happy and that's my ultimate goal even though i so I don't mind to go. <laughs> oh my god, it's it's hard to put my thoughts into feelings into words, and I hope yeah, I know you guys probably understand. And from the bottom of my heart, thank you for being here and sticking around. Um, I think the lastly, all I got I want to say is subscribe to the channel for more content like this. And uh, comment down below um, uh, what you think I should do. And um, thank you guys who also did the forum stuff on my first channel post. That was really appreciative. That uh, that feedback was uh, very much well-informed and appreciative. So um, uh, lastly, uh, I'm going to quote one of my one of the uh, one of the people that uh, told me to say what are YouTube topics that I should talk about. Here's what they said. I'm gay. That's a good ending. Have a good one, folks. I hope you guys have a good one. And make sure to stay healthy and awesome. Peace.